here in the Philippines, they have this culture of when when you get into a relationship with someone, you call them 24/7. We don't have this in Kenya. Like no, it's it's this, up to you. It's up to you. No, but every single Filipino that I know that's in a relationship, they always video call. She's <laughs> giving me the heart sign. <laughs> Our school is so cool. We actually have a bar over here, but it's not open and we have a pool table. People come after school to play. Hello everybody. Magandang Hello everybody. Magandang umaga sa iyong lahat. Ako po si Rebecca Nalyaka, nag-aaral sa Fatima University as a nursing student. Today is a very special day because it is my first day of school. Actually guys, it's not my very first day, but it's my first day of third year. This is my third year as a nursing student. Wow, grabe. I'm almost done with school and I am so, so, so happy. Because it has been a very long journey because before I used to do physical therapy, but now I'm doing nursing. I decided to switch to nursing. So that's why I took a bit longer. Anyways, as you can see, I'm already prepared. Here's my Fatima logo. I'm wearing my school uniform. I, I already removed the nail polish for my nails. I tied my hair back. So I'm just, I'm very ready for school. My mom is asking me about my piercing, but that one I will just cover it to the mask. No one will know that I have it. <laughs> Anyways, guys, so um, you're just gonna see the whole process of how it is as a black person, you know, going to uh, study here in uh, Philippines, which is a foreign country for me. And you guys are gonna see how it is for me. And if you have any questions, just comment them down below, okay? Anyways, let's go. Tana. There's my brother doing some last minute brushing. He's always the one that's making us late in this household each time we go to school. No, because God. he's really hard at waking up. You know, he's really difficult to wake up. So there's my brother over there. And my sister, Annette. There's my sister over there. She's in a mood right now. She doesn't want to turn around. But you can see her hair is green. So in her school, they allow green hair, which is so weird. Because when I used to go there, they didn't allow green hair for us. So I'm wondering, like, why did they change? I don't understand. Anyways. Yeah, of course. I will show everybody the house, and I will show everybody yourself. And there's our lovely little Katomata. Hi, little Kato Kato. Hi. He's eating his breakfast, guys. Hey, baby. How's your breakfast? Is it yummy? Yes, yes it is. Okay, he's basically done with it anyways. So let's go guys. Okay. Okay. Um. <laughs> no, okay, my mom is not in the mood to get filmed today. Okay, so these are the leggings that I wear. And I look like I'm not wearing any leggings, but I actually am. You see there's even a run on them. Because we're, we're supposed to wear leggings. So, anyways, here's my dad finally. I'm gonna be late already because my class starts at 7, but it's already 6.50, so. <laughs> I'm gonna be late, but it's okay because I know most Filipino lecturers, they're usually late, anyways. Sometimes, if I go on time, if I'm there by 7, I'm usually, they usually come at like 7.15 or even 7.30 or sometimes even 8, so it's okay. guys everybody as I told you my brother is always the last one <laughs> I've been waiting for him <laughs> I've been waiting for him for the past is it five minutes huh? he's always the last one to wake up last one to take a shower last one to brush his teeth <laughs> yes let's go <laughs> guys So much traffic oh my goodness i think maybe there was an accident because there's an ambulance and a bunch of different traffic i don't know why anyways so the next thing i'm gonna do is go and climb up a jeepney or a bus whichever comes first so that i can be able to go to school on time this is the sumolong highway by the way guys it's an antipolo this is what i wear come every single day wait for a 
bus. You can see the view of Manila from Antipolo. So pretty. People exercising in the morning. I'm wondering why there's so much traffic going. There's usually not this much traffic. I hope it's not because of an accident. This bridge in order to get there. There's a better view of the traffic underneath. So there's my school gate over there. And here's the FUMC, which is the hospital. There's a security check. So this is how our school looks like. There's some pine trees over there. It's really okay. It's not okay. It is beautiful. Yeah, it's nice. I like it, and I love the fact that they have aircon in the rooms as well. So, and there's the sign that says "I love oh, I love you" right there. This is one of the buildings, and the library is inside there. There's some plants to decorate the place. I don't know about you, but I feel like this is a really nice school. Like, it's pretty decent. Like, you know, I've seen worse schools. Fatima is decent when it comes to how it looks like. So here's where we can buy some food if you want, some snacks. Here in Omsen. Let me, let me say hi. So, this is my friend Neil. <laughs> Who's that? Say hi. Hi. This is my girlfriend. <laughs> That's Neil's girlfriend, apparently. I'm vlogging. <laughs> She's blogging right now. <laughs> <laughs> so, here we are. This is a, a place where you can come and study, chill with your friends. They, there's even a pool table over there. It's usually more active at night. It's just that it's during the day right now. So, that's why there's not many people here. And Neil <laughs> didn't tell me that we don't have face-to-face -face classes I'm sorry, today. I'm sorry, I didn't know too. Ah. <laughs> Guys, I literally, I, I literally dressed up. I looked so good. I, I cleaned my nails, wore my school uniform. Do you know how hard it is to wear the leggings? But I wore the leggings only to come here for Neil to tell me, oh, we don't have face-to-face -face classes they're online so this week we have online classes and I didn't know that like because ever since the pandemic we've been having um, two different sets right? set A and set B yeah so set A which is my set we had face-to-face -face classes last week but this week it's gonna be online classes so we go back and forth back and forth so next week we're gonna have face-to-face -face classes but anyways I'm kind of pissed because I came all the way here for nothing basically but it's okay guys, I'm just gonna have to continue this vlog um, the next time, like when I come to school when it's face to face. I will continue and I will show you guys how the classroom looks like, yeah. Oh yeah, sorry. <laughs> Our school is so cool, we actually have a bar over here, but it's not open and we have a pool table. People come after school to play. And we also have like a club thing inside that place. But it's mostly active, usually during the weekends, diba. Right? It's inside there, somewhere. Yeah. So you call her 24/7. Yeah. Let me see. <laughs> so, guys, I'm talking. I'm talking to Neil, and I'm saying that here in the Philippines, they have this culture of when you know, when when you get into a relationship with someone, you call them 24/7. We don't have this in Kenya. Like. No. It's, it's up to you, it's up to you. No, it's but every single Filipino that I know that's in a relationship, they always video call. <clears throat> she's, giving, <laughs> she's giving me the heart sign. <laughs> <laughs> me, personally, I don't know. Maybe I've never been in love as much as Nila is. But I've never, 
been in a relationship where I'm calling the person constantly. Maybe one day. Maybe cause, one day. Yeah, right? maybe one day. Because I've, gr I've grown up here. You so. Don't know how that yeah, or if I end up with a Filipino person, maybe they will be calling me 24 7. But I don't know if I can handle that personally. <laughs> because I didn't have any classes today, I decided to print out the modules that we were going to use this semester for the preliminary exams. So here they are. And there were so many actually. <laughs> And you know, being a nursing student is just, ugh, it's hard, it's challenging, honestly. But it was okay. And then afterwards, I met my friends. Hi, to my vlog. <laughs> FJ, I'm vlogging. Guys, I thought you said we were going to the library. Excuse me. Oh, no. ah! FJ, this is the bag that I gave him. FJ. I'm the bag. <laughs> <laughs> it's the bag I gave him this bag. Oh, yeah. so he's, I'm so happy that he's actually using it. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. FJ, I'm so happy. I'm so proud. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. So they're gonna go and eat. Oh, buy one, take one. See, chicken. Buy one, take one. So you see how our school looks like. There's a lot of different coffee shops that people can go to after school if they want to eat something or if they want to drink something with their friends. Where are you taking us? Uh, I wonder where FJ is taking us. FJ! Oh, you mean there's an eating place? Wow. Oh my goodness, I would have never guessed. There's a whole eating place here. Oh, and it's really cheap, guys. 60 pesos. This is like a carandiera type of, of um, food. But you know, one thing here in the Philippines I've noticed is people, you can never go wrong with food. Like, there's always going to be someone willing to eat whatever it is you're offering. They don't have food? <laughs> so my lovely friend FJ brought some spaghetti and yeah. I'm gonna taste it guys. Mmm! Everything! It's good. You know I'm actually intermittent fasting. I'm on a diet but FJ made me ruin my diet because of him. But it's because I love him. Great mm. Maybe I'm... Um, it's good but I don't know. <laughs> it's not spicy. It's, it's kind of spicy. Yeah. But it's okay. How would I rate it? Out of 10. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Look, thank you for the food. It's good though. Yeah. So, guys, I'm back again. This is a few days later because last time we had a. Uh, online it was an online class week but this time around it's face to face so that's why i am finally actually going to school this time around and i'm so excited because it's gonna be my first day face to face um, class for a third year and so i'm so excited and yeah so yeah let's go let's go let's go let's go let's go let's go i got new glasses guys i look so weird with my <laughs> Like. Usually you'll find students in the hallway, sometimes, not all the time, sometimes you'll find students in the hallway waiting for the professor or the lecturer to finish his or her previous class. So this is what we're doing, that's why there were so many students here because we were waiting for the other class to be dismissed so that we can enter. So this is how the building of our school looks like. We have so many buildings, we have like five or six buildings, but this is the one that I go to. Oh, I did, you didn't say hi to my vlog. Hi. So there's my friend from last time, the one who lied to me about coming. So finally it's time oh. <laughs> to enter inside. I'm so scared. I'm so scared because sir is going to be like, oh, Becky, why are you late? 
I forgot how fun school is, you know? Being with friends, catching up with your friends, you know, just seeing all the chismes, the gossip before school, and there's our teacher. I really miss, like, I forgot how fun and exciting school is. So, yeah. Okay, guys. Wait, hello, guys. I'm so sorry I forgot to vlog the remaining of the class but anyways i couldn't because it was a lecture so i thought it would, it would be it should have been disrespectful if i was recording during the lecture but um even after when the lecture was done i forgot to record when we left the class and i'm so sorry but anyways here i am right now walking home from school and so this is what typically happens i usually take a tricycle and then i walk home um because where i live tricycle is bawal bawal mag tricycle but so it's a bit of an exercise it's a bit kind of long not really like 10 to 20 minutes walk no like 10 to 15 minute walk so it's okay so what was i gonna say it turns out that I, I've, I've actually missed three quizzes <laughs> in the class that i went to because technically this was not my first it was not the first day of school it's just that i have skipped school um a bit because i was traveling <laughs> Um, but anyways, I need to catch up on that and the lecturer was kind enough to give me a second chance and he told me that tomorrow we have a really long quiz and if you don't know what that means, it basically means that um, it's going to be one quiz that covers a lot of the topics. So in my case, it's going to cover from week one, week two, week three and week five because we already did the week four quiz today and I passed by the way, yay! But anyways, so we're going to do the week like week one, two, three, and five quiz tomorrow, the long quiz tomorrow. And so I need to go home as fast as I possibly can and study, 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 because I need to be ready and, you know, we can do this, guys. <laughs> Anyways, thank you so much for watching. And if this is your first time here, please don't forget to like and to subscribe. I will see you guys next time. Bye. This is how my front view looks like. Wow, is it not beautiful? It's a beautiful sunny day. <laughs> Thank God where I live has a lot of trees. So even if it's sunny, technically you can still walk as long as you walk underneath the shadows of a tree, which is perfect for me.